All right, guys. Ooh, the sun is bright. Put these gooders on. Guys, it is chilly outside, and I honestly forgot I own this Outdoor Research Tantrum running jacket. Found it in the back of my closet uh, from a few years ago when we were running. And I actually found some actual, like some other winter clothing for running. So I'm pumped about that. Uh, this is like two sizes too small, but it's like 40 degrees out and this is doing just enough to keep the chill off of me. And another great feature is it has thumb loops. So I can put that down over my watch so I'm not tempted. Uh, we're doing just the roads out by my house, but I went left guys and uh, left is the hilly way. So we're gonna tackle some hills today on this one mile run. I'm excited. I probably just have a couple more seconds before we have to run and then we're off to the races. Let's get this mile run in and done. Oh gosh guys that one was was tough it's crazy how hills will really take it out of you overall let me catch my breath and we'll talk about this run when we get back to the house and when I can actually form Full sentences. All right, guys. All right, guys. That run is done. One mile down, and it was kind of tough. I'm not gonna lie. Normally, when I go running, I go right out of my driveway, and that leads me down to a flat stretch of road where I can easily get a mile and a half in, and turn around and come back and be done. And life is good. Today, though, we went left, and left takes me over some rolling hills, kind of through the country. Uh, it looks beautiful, uh, but it is definitely a harder run. And no, I don't think I'm ready for the hills yet, uh, but I think it's good to sprinkle them in. And guys, I'll be honest, I actually did better than I thought. In that mile run, I literally only walked one time, and that was when we made it to the very top of kind of, I guess you would say, the highest climb. I kind of just stopped to catch my breath and to turn around, and then we started to run down. And you can see that on the Strava data. You can see where towards the end of the run, uh, my pace just suddenly drops, but then immediately kind of picks back up. Uh, it was a good little just breather, but then we, we kept after it. And surprisingly enough, I felt fine after that little breather. I felt like we could have kept running and we could have pushed on. And I like that feeling. It's been the last few runs have honestly kind of felt that way where I feel like I can continue to run and continue to press on. But again, we're sticking to this running schedule. I did stretch before this run and during the run, I felt no tightness anywhere, none in the calves, none in my quads. It all felt actually really good, and that was encouraging. It just, it kind of proves to me that, Steven, you need, you need to be stretching. <laughs> this week's going to finish just like last week, where tomorrow is a mile and a half run. And then on Friday, I have another mile run. And then we kick off week five with a two-mile run. I can't wait. This was one of those short videos just so we could get one in and kind of keep this video streak going. Uh, I've got a lot of things to do today. Uh, I got home, we got cleaned up, I ate a little bit, and now I am on my way to go look at 
some cars. Uh, you see our lovely RAV4. It, it, it fits two car seats so well. But we have another one coming and uh, we're going to need a bigger vehicle. So that's exciting, uh, but it's also kind of sad because we have had zero issues with this car and I hate letting it go, but we get such good gas mileage in our Subaru that we're going to keep that car instead. Um, and so this is the one that has to go and so I'm, I'm got to go find a replacement. So we're going to go look a little bit today, but uh, yeah, fun stuff. All right, guys. I'll see you tomorrow on the mile and a half run and uh, we'll get after it. You know the drill, hit that thumbs up button, leave a comment below and hit that subscribe button if you enjoyed this video or you just wanna keep on with this journey and see the progress that we're making. Social media links are below, love to see you there. <sighs> All right guys, let's go find us a car, hopefully, and uh, I'll see you tomorrow in the mile and a half run that we've got going on. Until then guys, peace.